you gotta have like a flag for the dunes. So if you have a Jeep, a JL Jeep Wrangler or whatever, pop out this little, there's one of these little plugs. Pop that out. I drilled it out a little bit so that this pole would fit. Just slide it in until it goes all the way down. You're ready to rock. I just have to get it a little bit longer because it's not quite 10 feet. It has to be 10 feet. Rob and I are heading out for our first camping trip of 2022. We are taking the Jeep to Silver Lake Sand Dunes. Staying at the state park should be a pretty awesome time. The last time I was here, I must have been 17, 16 or 17. I went with my mom and Steve and some of their friends. So I remember it's an awesome place. It's gonna be cool, right? Yeah, and I can now sit in the front. Yep, Rob can sit in the front. We love camping yeah. and we love riding in the Jeep. So yeah. I felt like Silver Lake would be like the ultimate spot yeah. for us. So here we go. We were just driving and I had to pull over to see this thing. It's like a giant devil Look at head. this. What? <laughs> Why do they have this? I don't know. It's crazy. Yeah, <laughs> the yeah. stuff you see on the side of the road. That is so cool. Looks a bit cool. Our spot for the week, I guess for the next four days. So we're campsite 54, strategically placed between the bathroom and the lake. Got to unload our stuff and set up camp. I'm pretty stoked. Lucky Penny, nice. All right, let's unload the Jeep. Campsite set up, tent. The best part about a tent that has just two poles is that it doesn't take a lot to set it up. Got the roof in case we need it, cooking area, bikes. Rob's in the Jeep. He's already bored because he wants to go do stuff, which I can't say I blame him on because I'm also wanting to do that. So let's uh, hit it. Day two, Rob and I woke up, did some biking, had to go to the store to get some stuff we forgot. Did an intro. Rob recorded his intro. Now we're aired down, flagged up and heading to the dunes. Nervous, are you excited? A little, little bit of both. Yeah. We won't go too fast and do anything too crazy. Thank you. Unless you ask me to. Thank you. Right. See, look, this pole our flag has to hit. Can we get it? Mom would definitely not like this. It's definitely bumpy on the road in. <laughs> yep. Can you not go too, too fast? Yeah. I'm just doing it so we get up the hill. Look at how beautiful this is. That is pretty cool. Look at that. That big hill. Oh, yeah. Oh, definitely gonna go up it at some point. Well, not right now. We're gonna try our first big hill here. I'm nervous. It'll be fine. We'll go where somebody else is already gone. Oh, this is easy. We got this. Look at that. We made it. Yeah. You having fun? Yes. Too scary or no? No, not too scary. Just. I think once we do a few rips, yeah. you'll be good. Look at it's like a oasis. It's like the sand blowing on the dunes is cool. Yeah. Could we not do that one? Yeah, we don't. We won't do it just yet. yet. Tom and I are gonna get out and take a selfie for a thumbnail. Yeah. What do you think? Awesome. I think it's awesome too. Should we get a selfie together? Yeah. All right.
perimeter here. I like following those outside edges. I was gonna say that they're usually smoother, but these are not very smooth. <laughs> yeah. This is so narrow. Ooh. <laughs> ah, narrow. Oh, jeez. people go in there and do donuts. When I was here in my Jeep Cherokee when I was 16 or 17, I was doing donuts and uh, rolled the tire off the bead. What's that mean? It means like we had to take the, put the spare tire on and then take the car to a tire shop to get the tire repaired. Because I couldn't get it to hold air. Pretty steep. Yeah. All right, here we go. It. It's pretty good. Uh, look at the oh. <laughs> I got so wet. That was a fair amount of water. <laughs> Did you get wet, Rob? Yes. <laughs> Should we do it again? Yes. I'm gonna do it. Here we go. I actually got wet somehow. <laughs> also, it's covered up so it looks like it's not there at some part. Did you see the water splash over our heads? That was cool. <laughs> They have an RC car in the dirt over here a little bit. I feel like that's either a really amazing idea. Right. That is so cool. My mini Z's would definitely not work in there. I am pretty impressed with myself. I figured out how to cook bacon. I didn't even have to like Google or anything, but uh, it's coming out pretty well. I also figured out how to cook corn. That I did have to Google, and the first attempt was not so good. Rob and I are getting ready to head out to the dunes. It's our third day camping. Second day dunesing, and we're gonna rock it. We all flag hit. Spin the tank. There it is. Oh no. How did this guy get stuck right in the oh beginning? Oh my god. I wonder if he did that hair now. That is not the way to start.
Rob and I decided we're gonna hike this hill. And I guess in the video it doesn't look that humongous, but it's massive. And we have a white Jeep friend here too. <laughs> oh, that one's got black wheels. I really wanna do black wheels on ours. <laughs> but yeah, look at those people look like ants. Starting to feel much larger. Do we look like ants yet in the video? I was being funny. All right, look at this. It's getting steeper. It looks so much more steep. <laughs> it looks so steep now. It's literally like my camera is perfectly straight up right now. This is so. We've only gone like 10 feet. <laughs> Not there yet. Yeah, I'd leave him there. Good idea. Oh my gosh. My calves are on fire. Is that what this is? Those things are on fire. Almost there. I like feel like they're broken. <laughs> like jello. All right, let's keep going. Okay. Boy. I'm gonna stop recording for a second because I sound like I'm gonna have a heart attack. We made it. It's not at all what I expected on the other side. I thought the lake was gonna be right here, but it's just miles, I guess, of sand dunes. The lake's over there. Crazy. Oh, it's so fast. This is how I like it. Like, just put your feet down and slide a little. Yeah, me too. This is a great feeling. It feels oddly satisfying. I know. Whoop, don't jump. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my gosh, I can't stop. I thought the lake was right on the other side of the sand dunes. I didn't realize it was way more like hiking area or whatever. So like Really, the part that you can drive on is actually a pretty small part of this. Kind of cool that it's uh, so big. That's what she said. Doing some testing. Ford Motor Company. There's another test truck from Ford. I think that's so cool. This is my favorite part. Oh boy, here we go, here we go. It's gonna be deep. Oh, that was so deep. That was a big, big one. It was so much more full than yesterday. Right? <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. Even if it destroys the door, the door, so it's not, it's not like we have a, no roof in the back, and we can just unbuckle. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, we're soaking wet. I got, <laughs> I got wet on that one even. My, my shirt is soaked. Okay, I think. <laughs> that was Rob's idea. <laughs> we just got soaking wet because we went through a giant puddle. Thanks a lot, Dad. You're the one that said to do it. Not that deep. Well, you said go through the center. I was joking. <laughs> I think let's head back to get the campsite. They're not so bad. Why does it always go on the passenger side more? Can we switch seats? Yeah, you can drive. Yay. <laughs> that was pretty awesome though, right? Uh, That is debatable whether that was awesome or not. <laughs> he uh, buried his truck so they could get the quad in easier and then couldn't get the truck unstuck. So we gave him a yank. He's good. We're going to head back to the campground since our shirts are all wet. 
because somebody had to drive through a puddle. Yeah, you did. <laughs> you told me to. I did not. Head back to the campground, get cleaned up a little bit, maybe do some swimming. It's a lot of time later. We have a small potential issue, but I've solved it already. We brought the Jeep with no roof on it because I looked at the weather and it's not supposed to rain or anything. The sky is pretty dark right now. So I just happened to open the weather app and it was like 50% chance of rain at eight o'clock. So that's like a half hour from now. But at two in the morning, there's an 80% chance of rain. <laughs> so my plan here is that I just bought this tarp. So I'm gonna put a tarp over the roof or over the back part of the Jeep and hopefully that will keep it dry enough so that we don't have to sit in wet seats because, I mean, if the rain goes, I don't know. <laughs> it's not pretty, but I bet that that keeps the majority of the water out of the inside of the car. I guess I could put some garbage bags there if I wanted, but I think that'll do. I can put a little bit more duct tape on it.